Hey guys, it's the key on the show with Chicago Tribune, ChicagoNow.com. I'm here with Kofi Sirabo. Hey. I was, hope I didn't do it. You didn't butcher it. Okay. She did it. That's exactly how you say he my just, name. Listen, he just made me practice like 50 <laughs> times, gave me a hard time, but I got it right. She got it right. Now, if you don't know who he is, he is on Owns Queen Sugar, and that means you haven't been watching if you don't know. If you haven't been watching, you should be watching every Wednesday, 10, 9 Central. Exactly. Mr. Ralph Angel. Ralph Angel is the character that you play. Yes. It is. He's very complex. He is beautifully complex. Yes. Isn't that a little bit different from I we talked a little bit about your IMDB. You've had an impeccable, you know, acting career with that. <laughs> and then now you've come to own and you've had to really like delve deep into yeah. this character. Yeah. So how how is that for you as an actor? I mean, it's empowering. I feel like I've been working my whole life to get to this point. Mm -hmm. Um all the roles I've played have been, you know, much smaller in the um instance that I've never done a 13 episode TV series and been a lead. So um, to be able to be that that much of a narrative, you know, a social narrative at that, because Ralph Angel is so important to what's going on in the world, I just, I feel empowered, I feel responsible, and I feel like I just really want to do it justice for myself and everybody else who looks like me and who doesn't, you know? Yeah, that's what I really enjoy because I'm pretty sure that your story is very relatable to exactly. a lot of young men from the inner city everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah, you everywhere. know, um, if, if we're not giving up too much yeah. your character is out of prison on yeah. parole formerly incarcerated yes and is a single father single father which is i think is pretty cool because they yeah. usually have single moms exactly I, I can't lie i pulled from single mothers to create this this image of a single father okay you know like i feel like ralph angel again is somebody who isn't afraid of his sensitivity or vulnerability it's kind of been by force because of his past he's had to like spend much more time in tune with that okay know? basically because of jail and just the kind of life he lives. So, um, you know, it's interesting how I, I, you know, pull to create that, but I think it's just so cool that I am a man and it's different than what we usually see because we only see single moms. We don't really give much credit to single fathers, so. Now, I was a little mad at Ralph Angel when he go pulling out guns. I'm Everybody like, mad at Ralph Angel. Come on, get it together. Don't do that. I was like, don't do it. <laughs> That's the first episode. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, okay, so but then he gets, I'm pretty sure, you know, he got some really great news, you know, as the third episode <laughs> kind of came to a close, Yeah. and people are on pins and needles, because you guys are now starting kind of like your own family empire, right, right, which right, is cool. Right, right, trying, you know, yeah. and you know, the interesting part is we're still trying to work out our family dynamic, so you know, when it comes with business and family, and oh, yeah. you know how that goes. Oh, yeah, so. and I already see the rift between right, the sisters, and you feel a little, and you feel a little something. Kind they of just way. treat me like a little baby, you know, so. Well, I mean, I have brothers and I still kind of treat them. You remind me of one Watch of my brothers. Watch the show. You're going to learn some things. <laughs> no, You're going to learn to. He, he, he do me. You know, <laughs> I'm, a, you know. I'm a grown man. <laughs> I'm a grown, you know, that thing. But it's still. It's still it's all heart, love. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's, it's all love. love and still very heartwarming. So um, I kind of heard the word on the street, and I don't know how real this word on the street is because I'm not a gossiper and all, but yeah. Oprah really takes to you she really likes you <laughs> is it, is that it not, must be real is it real <laughs> i mean i would i would hope so and i think so i don't know what connotation you're saying that in but like no she really no, does like, take to me and she really has taken me under her wing and yeah i mean that's that's oprah yeah you know, we're in shy city like that's oprah I not know. much else to say that's oprah how is that working with her it's special you know like that's i'm 22 years old i've seen oprah in my life you know since i was a kid so to be able to actually be a part of her life intimately and personally and be able to like take her channel to another level with what we're doing with queen sugar it's 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 empowering really? once again 22 <laughs> yeah so you must have all the ladies like going wild like because i heard you're also the hot throb <laughs> of the show you watch the show what you think i think between <laughs> listen, i think between you what is it timothy oh timothy yeah Tree. Tim, i actually acted with him on okay. a on a, a little cameo movie word, or whatever word. shout out to tree yeah he is he's tall like mm -hmm. a tree too he's tall. <laughs> <laughs> no between the both of y'all tall then he, you're word, the chocolate and he's the word. hey we could do what that. is it caramel i guess i don't know what he is caramel like, cheese caramel, little, yeah, you know. butterscotch maybe <laughs> right exactly maybe something, something. yeah i mean both of y'all you know making the ladies go a little wild okay 
Okay. How's that taking that all in, though, as a 22-year-old man? I love it. I'm young. <laughs> you know, I love life. I'm exploring life. I love women. And, you know, I, come, I I was a bit chubbier as a kid. So, you no. know. I, I'm Yeah. And I didn't go to high school. I was homeschooled. So, I didn't Because really, you're from Ghana? Is it, you know, it has nothing were to you, do with that. Oh, okay. I was born and raised in L.A. And, um, oh, okay. you know, I was a little more of a quiet kid. You know, I had my little insecurities and whatnot. But I was working as well. So, there's a whole mixture of reasons why. Okay. But I'm young now in, in a different way. I'm a young adult, not just young. I'm 22, and I am not chubby anymore. And I love myself, and <laughs> I love women. So you know, chubby. great. Can't I gotta see a picture. You can see a picture on TMZ or something. <laughs> or can I get it in your pocket? They, they, no, I got it? a picture. Everybody asks, I, I need to keep it on my phone. Yeah, that, that's it's serious. It's for yeah, real. For real. For real. So what'd you do to like lose weight and get in shape? Man, I just stopped hanging out with people. Stop eating food. Not entirely, but I I used to eat Burger King in the morning, McDonald's in the morning, sodas. I just no soda, only water. You know, I started oh. eating brown rice instead of white rice. I didn't eat after seven or eight anymore. I started going to the gym. I started running. You know, just all kinds of little lifestyle changes that started to like equal up to like a whole new, you know, me. Oh, cool. Well, we're loving the new you. Dope. And again, you said it comes on when? On uh, Wednesday. Wednesday. Tonight, Tonight, tomorrow. Tomorrow, third tomorrow. episode, 103. So, you know, they need to check it out. Please do. It's a really good episode. And if you haven't seen one or two, check that out too. Yes. And then I already, wait, are they going to do four tomorrow or no. three? Just, yeah, now it's just one episode a week. So y'all got to wait. Ooh. They did that. They got y'all with one and two. Oh, okay. Well. Oh, I definitely want you oh. guys to check out another film that's going to a release this Friday. It's called Kicks. It's um, a movie that I'm in. Oh, somebody sent me some information on Kicks. Yeah. You're in that? Yes, ma'am. Oh, okay, okay. I am one of the leads. I play the villain in the film. Um, mm -hmm. A lot different than Ralph Angel's character, but kind of similar in a lot of ways, too. Okay. So, yeah, check that out. It'll be all over the AMCs and everything. So. <laughs> It'll be all over the AMCs and whatnot, so y'all okay. got to check that out. When? Tom tomorrow? Friday, September Friday. 16th. Yep. Okay, so yep. Friday, September 16th, and then tomorrow, watch OWN. Queen Sugar OWN, Queen 10 Sugar. Central. Yes, got you. Yes, yes, yes. All right, well, it was great talking to it you. It was great talking to you, We could probably too. do this all day, I was going to say all day. We got too many people like that. <laughs> <laughs> Cut it. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys. Appreciate it. All right. Thank you guys. And we'll talk to you later. Later. Okay. Let's do it again. All right. I don't know if you have time. So Let's do it. Three, Give me. Give me my ear. <laughs> no, you got some love. Nah, what, 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 what was it? your last name again. I told Siri, you five times. And Siri you Bo. messed it up the last time. I know. Too. Help me. Please. Siri Bo. Siri Bo. Cerebo. 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 Stop. See, somebody's. Three times. Cerebo. 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 Cereb